What's up, you guys? It's Zach Jack Dan back with another Every Marvel Legends video. This time we're talking about Every Marvel Legends 2 pack. So, back in the Face Off Toy Biz days in 2006, we had two different series once in May and one in November. Series one consisted of a Hulk leader, a couple of them variants, Daredevil Kingpin, a couple of variants, and the Captain America Red Skull with a variant with Baron Strucker. So here is the Captain America Red Skull. Here is the Captain America Baron Strucker. Of course, this is Captain America with his mask down. There's that Red Skull. And Strucker. Next, we have the Daredevil Kingpin. This is the Kingpin in his white suit. Daredevil with his mask up. There's Daredevil with his mask down. Kingpin in the white. And in the black. Next, we have the Hulk with a teeth grinding. And then this one was the variant with his teeth, uh, his mouth open. And then the leader with the more heart shaped head. And the taller head sculpt. So then we have series two, came out later that year. Three more sets of two packs, all with variants. So first off, you have the Iron Man versus Mandarin. And then you have the variant War Machine. And the variant Mandarin with the mask and the green uh, suit, whatever you want to call it. And then the unmasked with the red suit. Next, you had Wolverine and Sabretooth with their mouth closed. And you had the variant with their mouths open. There's a Sabretooth, mouth closed. And mouth open. And then last you have the Punisher 2 back with Jigsaw. This one he's got more of a grimace on his face. And you got a Jigsaw with a Punisher look on his uh, costume. And the one with him in a suit. That's it for Toy Biz. Then you gotta jump over to the Toys R Us exclusive two packs that we got after the SDCC Fan Choice Awards. And so these are the ones that won the Fan Choice. The Valkyrie actually won it, but all these other ones were kind of honorable mentions. So you had the Warpath in his X Force costume and the Red Deadpool as a two pack. And then you had the regular Warpath with the red and black versus with the uh, Deadpool in the blue and yellow costume. This one did not have a variant. It was just the Valkyrie herself with the Hulk. And again, this was the winner of the fan choice. Then you had two uh, Black Widow and Winter Soldiers. This one had her in a black costume and him with his short hair. And this one has him with his long hair and her in a silver costume so we have some more two packs with those old toy biz uh, box sets in 2008 and 2009 got four more box sets here uh, this is a electra and ronin and then there is a variant of this as well as scroll electra And this is the regular Ronin versus the green look to him. Like he's fighting Electra as a scroll, maybe. Then we have the Nick Fury and Ultimate Captain America. And of course, that's Ultimate Nick Fury as well. There's the Captain America. World War II looks like. So then you had the 
Fantastic Four box set with Mr. Fantastic and Thing. There's Thing. Then you had a Wolverine and Forge two pack. Next, you had another series of these come out. This was the Shield series. And you got the Hand Ninja in red with a Nick Fury or a alternate head with a Shield Agent. And then you got a variant uh, Dum Dum Dugan, also a Shield Agent head and the White Hand Ninja. Then you had the another Invisible Woman and Human Torch two pack here for Fantastic Four. Horrible Invisible Woman. But one of the best Human Torches. Then a more uh, Shield stuff here. Shield Super Spies. You had the Sharon Carter with the alternate Maria Hill head and the Stealth Armor Iron Man in this particular version. And then with the Maria Hill, you had the regular yellow and red Iron Man with the Tony Stark head. Also, you had the Super Scroll and the Kree Soldier 2-pack. There's that Kree Soldier with the two alternate heads, one blue, one regular. So Toys R Us came out with some more 2-packs in 2017, 2018. You had the Spider-Man Mary Jane 2-pack. You had the Cyclops Phoenix 2-pack. The Hydra 2-pack. Do some army building. You had the Claw and Shuri 2-pack. Also in 2017-2018. Some more of the Toys R Us and also an Amazon and 80th Anniversary 2-pack here. Here is the Target exclusive Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 2 Star-Lord and Ego. Here is the Homecoming Spider-Man and Iron Man Century Suit. Of course, that's Tom Holland as Spider-Man there. Then you had the Astonishing Ant-Man Toys R Us exclusive with Stinger. And then the AIM 2-pack to do your army building. And this was a like a fan channel exclusive. And then for Amazon, you had the Sentinel and Wolverine from Days of Future Past 2 pack. And then for the 80th line, you had the Havoc and Polaris. And this was like a fan channel exclusive as well. So also from the first 10 years line, you had several 2 packs. And then Entertainment Earth gave us some 2 packs in 2018. So we had Tony Stark and Iron Man Mark I from the, 80, uh, from the first 10 years line. The Thor and Sif. The Hulk and Hulkbuster. Ant-Man and Yellow Jacket. Captain America and Crossbones. And then we had the Scarlet Witch and Vision from Avengers Infinity War. Which was originally going to be a Toys R Us exclusive, but it got re released later. And then you had the Hydra Supreme and Arnim Zola. Fan channel exclusive. And here we go with some more two packs. From the 80 years line, you had the Wolverine and Hulk, the Colossus and Juggernaut. Thor Ragnarok, the Grand Master and Korg. Captain America and Peggy Carter. 
Ex-Con Luis and Marvel's Ghost from Ant-Man and Wasp. Scourge the Executioner and Hela from Thor Ragnarok. And Hela had three different head sculpts. Iron Man and Iron Spider-Man. That's the Mark 50 Iron Man suit. And then Deadpool and Hitmonkey with Deadpool. Called it the Suits 2-pack. So Target has some exclusives from 2016 and 2019. So we have this 2-pack with War Machine and Mark 27 Iron Man, which we call the Disco Iron Man. Then we have the Valkyrie and Thor 2-pack from Thor Ragnarok. The Killmonger and Everett Ross 2-pack. Falcon and Winter Soldier. Miles Morales and Spider-Gwen from Into the Spider-Verse. MJ or Zendaya, whatever you want to call her, from Spider-Man Homecoming and Spider-Man in his yellow school jacket. You have the Quantum Realm suits that you can swap the heads out on. Comes with the Hawkeye and Black Widow head. You got the Craven and Spider-Man beat up. To call it Craven's Last Hunt. And then from San Diego Comic Con 2019, you had the Elders of the Universe, the Collector, and the Grand Master. There's the back of that box. Collector came with two different head sculpts. So also, we had some Walmart two packs from 2007. 2019 and then also some box sets we'll be getting in 2020 of two packs. We have these from Walmart with the Cable and Marvel Girl. Domino and Cannonball. And then coming in the future here we have the Ultimate Spider-Man 2 pack with Ultimate Vulture. Or Vulture. I'm not sure if his ultimate. I guess he is. Then you had the Netflix two-pack with Luke Cage and Claire Temple. And then the Loki and Corvus Glaive two-pack. Coming this year, we're getting the Old Man Logan with the Baby Hulk and the also the Old Man Hawkeye with two different head sculpts. We're also getting a Magneto from the Fox universe with two different head sculpts with the two uh, Professor X with both different head sculpts. And then we're getting the Negasonic Teenage Warhead with the Deadpool from the uh, Fox Deadpool movie. And jumping way back to the Spider-Man classics, you have the two packs with the Spider-Man and the Resorbing Man, Doc Ock Spidey, Punisher Spidey, Abomination Spidey, Venom Spidey, another Venom Spidey, Spidey Spidey, Spidey Lizard, another Spidey Spidey, Spider Man. Hobgoblin and then blue back card back and Spider-Man Sandman. Then we have the Spider-Man Origins gives us the Spider-Man versus Green Goblin from Spider-Man 1. From Spider-Man 2 you have the Doc Ock Spider-Man. And from Spider-Man 3 you have the Spider-Man and Venom. 
And then again, back from Spider-Man 1, you got the beat up Spider-Man with the Green Goblin. The Mary Jane and Spider-Man. And then another Green Goblin Spider-Man. And then jumping over to the X-Men 2000, this is right before the Toy Biz started building the Marvel Legends. You got the Wolverine Hugh Jackman with Rogue and a Pekin. You got the Wolverine with Sabretooth. And the Wolverine with Magneto. And then you have a two-pack that shows a comic version with the movie version called Mutant Evolution of X. And then we got the Walmart exclusive two-pack with the movie versions of Wolverine and Beast. This was <clears throat> put out during X-Men Origins Wolverine. And then also a two-pack with Colossus and Cyclops from that same series. So guys, that's it. That is all the two-packs. So many of them. And here's kind of a wish list of what I'd like to see in the future of two packs. Most on the list. <clears throat> Wouldn't mind seeing a Havoc and Cyclops from AOA as a two pack. Also from AOA, I wouldn't mind seeing the Rogue and Magneto two pack. And then since Rogue and Gambit are now married, let's get a Rogue and Gambit two pack as well. And then back when Storm and Black Panther were married, let's get the wedding scene. Guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Leave any kind of comments. Hit that notification bell so you're aware of any new videos that I have. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Hit that thumbs up, and I'll talk to you guys later. Guys, don't forget to check me out on Instagram, Twitter, Pinterest. You can find all the photos that you want of these videos.